Check out all my books on audible.com. Hi folks, Dr. Bob. Breathing exercises. I do, you know, breathing exercises all the time myself. I'm just going to give you three really quick ones you can do. First of all, you always want to breathe in through your nose and then you can exhale through your mouth or your nose. But you want to breathe in because it kind of filters the air and it relaxes you more and it gets uh, oxygen up into the brain and that's what you want. And when you do a breathing exercise, you always do it slowly. You don't do anything rapidly because, you know, that will increase the CO2 in your bloodstream and you're trying to get that out of there. But um, here are three of the ones that I use. Um, and the first one is... You know, you take your you take your thumb on this side, and you close one nostril, and breathe in, and then go to the other side, and breathe out, and then keep the two fingers there. Breathe in, switch. Breathe out. Breathe in. Now you always switch at the top when you back and forth. So up there you switch that out. Breathe in, switch, breathe out, breathe in, switch. Now you do that seven times, seven times. What that will do is help balance your entire body. It'll help your endocrine system. It'll make you feel relaxed. It's very, you know, brings a lot of oxygen into the body, a lot of oxygen to the brain. The second one is for high blood pressure or just re relaxing and say you get stressed out and your pr blood pressure is up high so um, you just want to get those arms out there now this one you do when you're you can do it while you're watching television or anything but don't watch anything like uh, some kind of a, a action movie because you know that'll make the heart rate go up so just kind of close your eyes and breathe in all the way and then hold it now don't hold your breath because you don't want this <sighs> No, you just want to breathe and then keep trying to breathe in more and more and more and more and more and just relax. So if you're sitting down doing this is a good way to do it because and I'm putting my arms out because what you're trying to do is you're trying to get the the blood into the capillaries and capillaries are the smallest little, you know, veins are at the end or the end of the veins and you know they they can handle like one or two uh, blood cells at the most. So you're trying to get them uh, get as much out there. What you're trying to do is you're trying to expand this balloon of your body. Now if you think about a balloon, it's under a lot of pressure like this. Now if you can expand that balloon, well it won't be under such pressure, see? And that's what you want to do and that'll lower your blood pressure. So this is how I lower my blood pressure. <clears throat> if you want to take your blood pressure, do this exercise. Take five minutes and breathe in. and then relax. So you hold it up there about 10 seconds and just keep doing it for about five minutes. Very slow, very, very, uh, just getting that in and keep trying to bring in more and more air because you're expanding the, the body, expanding the capillaries. I look at it as a balloon, you're expanding that balloon. That'll lower your blood pressure 10 points right there. Now last but not least, and this is one of the best ones, I call it the crying exercise. So when you see little kids or sometimes you see girls and they start crying and crying, they'll give you this thing at the end where they go, you know, this thing. So you breathe in and then it, hold it for a second. Don't hold your breath, just hold it and then give it one more. That will really get the CO2, the carbon dioxide out of your body more than anything else. And so I do that one all the time because that one, it really makes you feel fantastic. And you know, if you're a little down, you're a little depressed, do these breathing exercises. It'll bring a lot more oxygen into the body. So this last one is just, you know, you know, like I said, that when people are crying, sometimes children are crying. They give you that last, <laughs> you know, and, and that's the, what they're doing. It's just a natural thing. You're just getting all that tension and all that carbon dioxide out of your lungs. And uh, it just relaxes you more than anything else. That's my best one. I like to do that one all the time. To relax and kind of um, don't worry about anything have some calm music on because you don't want to have anything that's you know racing or anything you're trying to calm the body you can do all the other stuff later but when you're doing this just and then you do that you know again relaxing but this last one with the breath that's my favorite one dr bob breathe easy see you next time
Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave your comments below. Share this video. It helps out a lot with the algorithms. And uh, I'm trying to build up the channel after the disaster that happened a couple of years ago.